Hey guys, welcome back to our channel Mother Baby Care. So today's video is about how to take care of your baby's umbilical cord stump after birth. So let's start this video. Taking care of your baby's umbilical cord stump after birth is essential to ensure it heals properly and reduces the risk of infections. Here are some steps to follow. First, keep it clean and dry. Keep the stump clean and dry at all times. Use a soft damp cloth to gently clean around the base of the stump during diaper changes. Avoid using alcohol, hydrogen peroxide or any other cleaning solutions unless advised by your healthcare provider. Second, fold diapers down. To prevent the diaper from rubbing against the cord stump, fold the top of the diaper down so that it sits below the stump. This helps keep the stump exposed to the air which aids in drying. Third, avoid immersion in water. Until the cord stump falls off, it's best to avoid giving your baby a full bath in a tub. Instead, you can give your baby sponge baths or use a damp cloth to clean them. Fourth, exposed to air. Keep the cord stump exposed to air as much as possible. Allow it to breathe by folding down the top of the diaper or dressing your baby in loose fitting clothes that wouldn't cover the stump. Fifth, watch for signs of infection. Keep a close eye on the cord stump for any signs of infection such as redness, swelling, foul odor or discharge. If you notice any of these signs, Contact your healthcare provider immediately. Sixth, use diaper that has cut out. Some diapers are designed with a cutout or a special notch to accommodate the cord stump without rubbing against it. Using these types of diaper can be helpful. Seventh, wait for it to fall naturally. Do not try to speed up the process by pulling or twisting the cord stump. Allow it to fall off naturally, which typically happens within 1-3 to three weeks after birth. 8th, Proper Handling Always handle the cord stump gently. Avoid any pressure or pulling on it as this can cause discomfort or bleeding. 9th, Wash your hands Ensure that your hands are clean before touching the cord stump to minimize the risk of introducing bacteria. 10th, Keep it visible. Position the diaper below the stump and check to ensure it's not concealed beneath the diaper or clothing. 11th, consult your healthcare provider. If you have any concerns or questions about the umbilical cord stump or if it hasn't fallen off within three weeks, consult your healthcare provider for guidance. Remember that the umbilical cord stump falling off is a natural part of the healing process. Proper care and hygiene will help ensure that the stump heals without complications. By following these guidelines and providing proper care, you will help ensure that the stump heals without complication, leaving your baby with a healthy and unblemished belly button. Always trust your healthcare provider's recommendations when caring for your newborn's umbilical cord stump. So that's all about today's video. If you guys have any questions regarding this topic, you can ask them on the comment section. To know more on this topic, you can click on the link given in the video's description box. Visit our website www.motherbabycare.in and also like our Facebook page www.facebook.com slash motherbabycare.in Like share this video and do subscribe our channel Mother Baby Care. Thanks for watching this video.